Rocky Fan Report. Aloha and mahalo. I am God, the Hawaii Blue Fan. I am the guy with a with a uh, personality that's more abrasive than 20 grit sandpaper. I'm louder than the loudest steam engine, and I'm the one who gives you all the fun. Yes, that's me, Guy the Hawaii Blues fan, the host of the Blue Note Fan Report. Welcome to the show. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We got E here. We got Brad Pond here. Who else is here tonight? Tell me, tell me, tell me. I don't know if uh, Lance or Ashley will be along, but there's a few things to talk about. Uh, the Blues have recalled Santini on emergency conditions. Um, basically, that tells me Bortuzzo is out. Um, they're not going to say what his injury is, but, it, I mean, it's got to be pretty serious, right? Um, the Blues decor is is... Yeah, in shambles. And and this does not bode well for the series. It does hurt the series a lot. Um, but there is, you know, you could get both Letty and Scandella back. And, oh, my goodness, is that like, oh, Scandella sucks. Scandella sucks. He's so bad. He's so bad. Scandella's not as bad as you think he is. I loved it, yes- I loved it yesterday. Oh, we had Scandella out. We had Scandella out. We had Scandella out from the same people who were complaining about Scandella. All season long. All right. Makes sense, right? A um, couple of the groups, there were some posts that just jumped at my, you know, jumped at me. I will not name names or groups, but there was a post that said, I think that the Blues should just play five defensemen and use one of the two way forwards as a defenseman because they probably play both positions. They play different positions in college. Well, you know, um, first of all, I, I could only think of two, maybe three blues that actually played college hockey, right? Not most two, three, right? Um, and for the most part, for the most part, um, by the time players are in their teens, they don't change positions. Right, they kind of figure their positions out when they're, you know, nine, ten, eleven, and very, very, very rare do you see somebody change positions. Center to forward, yes. A forward or a center to defenseman, almost never, never. A uh, Facebook user is someone who does not like Scandella. I do not know who this Facebook user is. Um, let me see if I can figure out who he is. He or she is. Uh, I have no issue with Scandella. I like Scandella's play. I, I think that um, people put him under a microscope, which has has a bit. Oh, Doug Shelton. Doug, uh, welcome, welcome, my friend. Um, welcome to the show. I didn't think you were going to show up today. Uh, yeah, Ashley's not a fan of. Uh, oh, now she goes. She misses Scandella. Well, we miss you, Ashley. We miss you, um, but I, I Scandella gets put under a microscope. It, it's it's just like Tarasenko. Tarasenko gets put under a microscope. His mistakes get magnified. Ah, uh, Ashley's working, so no Ash today. Um, not. I mean, I I try and not look at players under a microscope. I really don't. I think when you look at players under a microscope, you 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 normally see. The misses. Oh, you like Scandella. Okay. Um, oh, the only one who likes Scandella. I misread that. I misread that. Right? Um, I actually like Scandella. I miss Ashley, too. Yeah, well, you know, everybody misses Ashley. Nobody misses me. So, uh, I've, I've, had, I've had people say, where's the show? Where's the show? Oh, I don't feel like, well, Ashley can do the show. Right? So, um the the the, the, the I, I'm sure that the majority of the people that watch this don't watch for me, but yeah, I, I, I'm opinionated. Okay, so what? You know, anybody who does this, they're opinionated, right? Um, you 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 are what you are. You do what you say. Um, I I liked what Scandella brings. Oh, um, waiting on an email to get some wave. 
to wave the rally flags at the game tomorrow and Sunday. Oh, that'd be cool, bud. That'd be cool. Um, when I tried to do the show, I only had four viewers. Yeah, that was, our, I bet you if you do it now, it won't be like that. It won't be like that. Uh, I am who I am, as Condry says. <laughs> I like that. Tammy says, I'm guilty of that, but I think so and think they're only human, but I also support anyone with the blue note on their chest. Uh, unfortunately, uh, maybe Ashley, but but not as um, not as appeasing to the eye or to the ear. Apparently, um, look, I I want the show to take off, I and mean, that's it. Where there's to it, and I'm opinionated, and I'm gonna when when someone puts something out there that that makes absolute zero sense to me or has falsehoods in it, I'm gonna respond. I try not to, but, you know, that's just who I am. I did it in a group. I probably shouldn't have gotten as hard as I did. Um, I apologize to that group per, to the, to that group for doing that. Um, I'm not going to, and I won't name names. You know, if I was a jackass, I would name names. I'm not going to do that, right? I, I'm not going to do it. I, I'm going to somewhat leave sleeping dogs lie. Uh, but at the same time, I was trying to figure out how many blues have actually played college hockey. And right now I can come up with maybe three, right? Uh, the two I know for sure, absolutely sure, are um, Pareko and Falk. The one that I'm not 100% sure, but I think so, is Joshua, right? Um, I know none of the Russians played college hockey. There's five players out right away. Uh, let me, let me try something here real quick. Uh, see if I can bring this up. Uh, one of my favorite websites when I'm doing the show. Uh, now, I mean, I understand what the guy's saying. It's just like, I'll be on it. It's just like me yesterday with, um, you know, Bruby pulling the goalie with seven minutes to go and everybody's how, how stupid it is. But I understood what he was trying to do. And because of that, I didn't see it as stupid. I think that if he'd have waited a little bit, it would have, it would have definitely helped. And so he's got to, you know, deal with people uh, again, looking at the, the surface and not, not deeper into it. Um, Barbashev did not play college hockey. Uh, Bennington, I don't think, played college hockey. Brown didn't. Bortuzzo, he may have. I don't, excuse me, I don't think so. Bushnevich didn't. Falk, I know, did. Now let me check something here real quick, see if something comes up. Amateur team. So, okay, when the amateur team, it shows has a college team. Okay. So I can do that. It just takes a lot. I'll have to go at one by one then. Uh, maybe. Let me get back to where I was. Uh, uh, where, where, where was I at? Where's the Here's the roster. Okay. So go back. And now I, I, I don't have you guys up, so I can't see you. Uh, Bortuzzo, I'm almost certain didn't. Nope, he didn't. He was listed as the uh, ranger. I mean, for Walker, I know, didn't. Torpachinko, I know, didn't. Thomas may have, but I don't think so. Right? Um, Shen, I don't think so. Oh, he was a first-round pick. He didn't. Um, I, I almost say that he didn't play college hockey. Nope. He didn't. Uh, like I said, I can only think of the three. Right, and I'm not even sure Joshua did. I have to pull him up. Uh, yeah, no, Joshua did at Ohio State. Okay, so I got that right. So the, I, those are the three that I know of. Right. Um, let's see. Not that it was stupid. I just wish he would have made sure that he had control of the puck before doing so. A and that's where I'm at there. I'm just sick of someone stating how good looking Scandella is to them. And if we talk, if we only talk about his playing ability, he is more impactful than I give him credit for initially. 
And I get that, Ash. I really do. I, I see where you're going from there. Um, looks like the caps are coming back on uh, Florida. Uh, nope, no, Florida's Florida's coming back. The Rangers are up three to two with uh, just under just over 14 minutes left in the third. And Florida is getting their revenge. So the scripts have been flipped. The scripts have absolutely been flipped. Uh, no, <laughs> uh, no, this is not you. This is not you. And I don't think that this person is in your group, my friend. Um, by the way, for this person here, um, I know that you are where you're watching this from is the uh, STL Blues fan clan. If you go to the top of that post, right, to that post, um, it might say see more. It'll say something. I'm going live using StreamYard. Um, click here so your name can be seen. If you click on that link, It'll allow me to see your name, and then you click back, and then I'll know who, who's talking and make it a little easier on me, Doug, if you don't mind. Um, Tammy agrees. Uh, thank you for that, Doug. Yeah, we, it, we know it wasn't you, Doug. It was somebody else. But you look, I know what the person was saying, and, and in some ways, okay, at the surface, it makes a little bit of sense. But when you look under the surface of it, first of all, very few of the Blues have played college hockey, which he stated. Um, second of all, once these guys hit 10, 11 years old, they get their positions. And it doesn't change. It very, very, very rarely changes. Um, the only change, I mean, and, and very, very rarely does a forward go to defense or a defenseman go to forward. Very rarely. Right? Now, I know you will see a defenseman play forward. But what you do not see very, you know, you will not see is a forward play defense. You almost never see it. Right. And, and, and I wish Lance was here because I can't think in the modern world, actually, maybe I'm, I'll, you know what I'll do? I'll send Wendy a link. Maybe Wendy's watching and uh, Wendy would come on. Cause when, if, if anybody would know this, it would be Wendy, right? Wendy would know, you know, uh, if a guy did that, I, I, Honestly, don't think so. Um, or I can't think of in the modern era. I, I can't think of anybody that that has done that. Um, so I'll kind of send something the link. And I appreciate each and every one of you watching. If you are watching, don't forget to give me that little thumbs up on uh, on Facebook and YouTube and all those places. We really appreciate it. Uh, Andrea Zimmer Weiser. I oh, know my buddy Andrea. Brad Pond. Dan Bichetta. And Tammy Pemberton, thank you so much for those thumbs up. We greatly, greatly appreciate it. Okay, so what do the Blues do now, right? Well, Santini is Santini. That's all he is, you know. Um, he did well for us last season when he brought him up in the playoffs. But, then, you know, there were other guys that were hurt. There was just way too much. He had Perron out and, and things like that. So, with that all being said, you know, Santini wasn't going to be a boost. What, what I think the Blues need to do is focus more on their offense, right? They, they, they did not focus on their offense in the last game, and there were too many mistakes made. There were too many, um, oh, wow, Florida is just pounding them four to one. Actually, might be, yeah, four to one now. Florida is just putting it on. So that's going to flip, right? Uh, he came in when he came in for a little bit last season um, when, when the Blues had all the injuries and COVID stuff. I know he was in for a little bit. I don't remember how much. Let me uh, let me see if I can pull him up. Uh, Santini, S A San. Here we go, Steven Santini. He's been in the league since 2016. Um, he is a college player from Boston College. Uh, <laughs> now that we're talking about that. He played for the New Jersey Devils. He has a total of 114 games. Uh, he played one year for Nashville. Last year, he played three games for us. During the regular season, I don't know about the playoffs. I can look. Uh, let me find here. Uh, playoffs. Last year, he played two games for us in the playoffs. Right. And he has zeros across the way. He took three shots. Um, he was on the ice for 29 minutes. He had, he attempted eight shots, uh, 14, 16 time on ice. 
three blocks, 13 hits, two giveaways. You know, not much. The extras here are not good. Uh, three of his shots were blocked. He missed the net twice. Uh, shots through percentage is 37.5. Um, you know, and that that's about it on him. Uh, let's see. His Corsi was 51.4. Uh, his Corsi relative is 6.0. I think anything above five is good. No, actually... Uh, I'm not sure how Corsi relative works. I'd have to see it more. I mean, he, he he's what 25, right? You know, it, it, it's a stopgap. If we got to, hopefully, he's just a six guy. Ah, oh, there we go, Tan. There we go, Doug. Thank you, thank you, Doug. I appreciate that. Now we can see you. Um. Uh. Chris says I like Walker, but he gets crushed every time he has the puck. I've seen that too. I have seen that. I like Walker. I, I like what I like that he's um he's got good puck control, right? He, he's good at protecting the puck, but he does get hit a lot. And he's a smaller guy. Uh Rangers, uh, oh, Tammy's giving us the Rangers are our four to two, and Panthers are up five to one. Again, sc script flips, right? This is exactly what happened in game one. Everything's the scripts flipped, right? And and, and we saw that. So there's a chance that um, uh, the Predators who swapped their goalie out, which, you know, should, I don't know, I don't know where to go with that, but there's a chance that the Predators could be that team that flips the script. Now, remember that Boston did not flip the script, and they got beat, again, pretty handedly. Uh, so we will see how that co plays out. Uh, let me see. I'm trying to see. Yeah, this game's got about 11.30 to go. Oh, actually, I think it should be done by 3.45 when the uh, – since it's only on – so this is this is um, on TNT and TBS. It's not on any other channel, and I don't think they have another channel to put it on. They might. So, you know, we'll see. But I think that they'll delay the start of the game for this one more than likely. At least that's what I accept. expect. You're right, Tammy. I said the Canes. So, you know what, guys? I need your help, man. Give me some room to talk. Give me some stuff to talk about so I don't talk about the same old drivel uh, time and time. Um, another thing that I saw was that everybody but O'Reilly played great in that in that season, uh, in that game. And, and I'm sorry, there's O'Reilly was a minus three, though he did have a decent game. There were other players that played good. You cannot fault. I mean, Tarashenko and, and, and Kairou, both score goals. How, how, I mean, if you score a goal, that's not a bad game. Okay. Um, and Tarasenko's goal was an absolute snipe. I mean, there was no doubt about it that, you know, right? Uh, Nashville comes out more physical tonight. I can see that. I, 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 I think they have to be right. Um, but I also think that Nashville needs to control the puck, right? Nashville has to take the puck away from, uh, the avalanche and, and that's all that's all there is to it you you have to keep the puck longer than they do even if you keep it in your own zone you have to keep the puck you have to keep you know you you cannot let them get shots you've got to be able to get a cycle going you you've got to be able to to do more than they are well the rangers made it five to two so this script is absolutely flipped after their three overtime game in the last time um Sorry about that. No, I don't, Tammy. No, I don't. I I, I really don't. Um, I I think I think if it was going to affect him at all, it would have. I mean, they wouldn't have got him in. I mean, and I don't think he's going to lie if he can't see, right? So so I don't think it affected him at all. Maybe I'm wrong, but I I don't think. Uh, make their top line play D. I agree with that, Chris. I absolutely agree with that. I think you have to do that. I think you've got to to make those things happen. You've got to you've got to force you got to force the Avalanche to get out of their comfort zone. And in the last game, they were absolutely in their comfort zone. And then the other thing you got to do is Kadri. You you've got to make Kadri make that mistake. You've got to get under his skin. You've got to give him that chance to make that big hit that he's just got to make. And, and, you know, then he's gone. 
So for for Nashville, I think you've got to really you've got to get into you've got to get into the Avs head, right? And you do it you do it early. You got to score early. If they can score an early goal and not give one up, they've got a chance. But if they give up goals early again, I mean they gave up two goals on the first two or three shots. Right? And then it was just they gave up a power play goal, they gave an in straight goal, they gave up a shorthanded goal. It, it it was just bad all the way around. Aaron O'Reilly is good work ethic. I don't think he is going to lie to you if it affects him. And, and I don't either, right? I'm with you there, Aaron. I'm with you there, buddy. Uh, Patrick Gumbutter, thank you. I don't think I've seen you before. Ashley's giving us a little love. To everybody that's watching us on uh, Facebook, we appreciate that. Give that love away. We really, really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. What change do you think each team will make to win tomorrow? To win tomorrow, <laughs> to win. Um, okay, good point. Good question, E. Uh, good question. The Blues, I think, need to. Um, the Blues need to, to to. Blues need to take control of the game early, and control the neutral zone much better than they did in the last game. And then they've got to get down and get the cycle in and not be one and done, right? Mark Andre Fleury was on his game. He was they they were one and done. They they didn't get great looks. They didn't get good openings. It it was it was bad, right? Um, Nash or Nashville, Minnesota needs to stay out of the box. Minnesota needs to stay out of the box. I don't have a problem with the you know believe it or not the Blues penalty kill wasn't as bad as everybody thinks it was. I mean they were two for they were one for three. However. The Blues, I mean, it's only three penalties. Nashville's case stayed in the box the whole game. So I, I think for Nashville, they have to stay out of the box. Uh, now, the Blues were only one for five on the on the power play. You know, that's got to be better. You, you've you got to, you've got one of the best power plays in the, in the league. You know, you're number one on the road, number two overall. You've got to make that happen. You have got to go out there and, and, and when they put you on the power play, get in there. Now, what Minnesota did very well was stack the blue line. The blues had a lot of trouble getting in. Well, if they're going to stack the blue line, you have to fire it in deep with somebody coming in with speed because then they get behind. Um, and, and the goalie has a little bit of a chance, but he's more than likely what he throws it out. It's going to get caught. So in my eyes right now, the best thing for the blues to do is to push the play, right? Push the play. Push it, push it, push it. Take the face off and push it. Get down in their zone and and get Flurry uncomfortable, right? If you get Flurry uncomfortable, I think that's what's going to, that will be everything that you need to do to win this game. Get Flurry uncomfortable. It started to get uncomfortable for him. And then, um, you know, the Blues make a turnover and it goes in the back of the net. Um, who so is a question mark to me, right? He has got to play better tomorrow, right? He he has got to play better tomorrow. I know no one wants to blame him for any of those goals, but he, I'm sorry, at least three, if not four, the five he allowed were on him, right? Uh, and, and, and I just, I... I was I I was pretty certain, you know, I, I watched and you you can't play like that, right? The broken stick. Okay, I'll give you that one. But that's like the, the broken stick and the two on three are the two two on one. I'll give you that. But other than that, I you know, of the five goals, the other three I think are against him. I, I think are ones that he should have stopped. Right? Um, rebound control. I've been talking about that for a while. I, I even have a song for it. <laughs> right? I even have a little bit of a song for it. Yeah, Actually, I said, that's this song. Say again. I said, yeah. Flip flopping around. The puck's at the net, and I'm flip flopping around. That, that's all he did. He, 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 he consistently flip flopping. He's consistently. You know the 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 goal where that la- the third goal mm-hmm. that was him flip flopping around, 
oh, it hit me. I got to do this and that. And woohoo. Right? I, yep. You know, that, you know, I, 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 it, if he doesn't do all this extra mumbo jumbo, right? He, if he doesn't do the mumbo jumbo, oh man, are we going to be on, are we on ESPN tomorrow or TNT? We might be on TNT tomorrow. I thought, I thought it, was it was on ESPN. I thought it was on TNT on Sunday, but I'm, I definitely could be wrong. Yeah. No, oh, well, TNT just showed um, tomorrow. They showed two games tomorrow. They didn't show us, so. Um, but they only showed four games, so uh, hopefully we're on ESPN tomorrow. We are on TNT tomorrow. Oh, wow. Wow. Well, We're also on Bally Sports Midwest. We're on Bally but... Sports, yeah. Well, again, Bally Sports, you, everyone forgets that I don't live in St. Louis. I don't well, get, I well, was saying that for our viewers who do live yeah, in St. Louis. St. Louis, okay. Uh, absolutely, Benny is better at scrambling, mm-hmm. right? He's a better puck handler. Um, he, he's he, he he's more when he's plays by the seat of his pants. That's when he's at his best. And he's at his best. Absolutely, he is. Right. But um, it sounds like Baruby is still going to go with Huso tomorrow. Yes, I see that, and and I don't have an issue with that. I really don't. Okay. Um, however, I think the leash has to be short. Yeah. Right, I mean, you you get down three three nothing again in the first, you're in, you're you're in dramatic trouble. Okay, I mean, if he if he's gives up two goals on three shots again or two shots, which was what it was last time, um, no, it, it, it's time to yank him. Right, you can't have him do this stuff again. Right, you remember you remember the beginning of last season, actually most of last season, he would give up a goal in like the first five shots. Mm-hmm. Almost every game, he gave up a goal in the first five shots. Yep. In fact, the only time, I think the only time he didn't is when he got shutouts. Mm-hmm. Other than that, he gave up a goal and he gave Which up a goal early. Which, that season, he, he only had one. Yeah. So, so he had the one shutout. I thought he had more than that. No, they each had one. Each had one? Okay, you might be you're right. You're right. And we didn't get him towards until towards the end. And towards the, the end, yeah. Um, look, Huso played well this season, Okay. However, he didn't play – he didn't play – there's a point in my eyes where the league starts to figure him out. Yeah, it happened right? to Bennington, so it's going to happen. Actually, now here's the difference. It didn't happen until Bennington until two years later, mm-hmm. right? You look at Bennington from – in 2018, 19, 19, right, when he came in in January – and then you look at him to 2020. His numbers in tw- in 1920 are are just as good. Yeah, they were good until the bubble. Right? They, they, they were just as good. He had three shutouts in that period. Mm-hmm. It wasn't until he gets into the bubble that, you know, him having COVID and some other things that it, it, it went down. And then last season, in in the shortened season, the, the division-only season, they figured him out. Mm-hmm. They had him figured out. And I think this year, he actually started to play really well. He played well up until December when he got COVID. Mm-hmm. Right? And he I don't think he recovered from COVID until, oh, great, man. God, Chuck, you know, do you know how freaking jealous I am right now, Chris? <laughs> you, know how, you know how freaking mad I am and jealous I am? And and I and I say this, Chris. I say this with all the love I can muster, right? And you know this. You get to rate do all this because of me, right? And I don't mean that in a negative way. And I'm not trying to take away your thunder, but you joined the the Warriors because of the shows I did about the Warriors. And you, I know you admit that. So, but that just makes me jealous. And it's not. I, I I'm admittingly jealous, right? Because I know if I was there, I'd have those chances too because I'd be a member of the Blues Warriors, but it is what it is. And I hope that didn't come out too wrong. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't come out too wrong, did it, Ashley? It started to, but then you fixed it. Okay. Right. And, 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 and I think Chris will... will uh, I'm not sure what the nope is there, Chris. Nope, it didn't come out wrong uh-uh. to him. 
Uh, but I think Chris will agree with me to some point. Yeah. It, 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 will you, Chris? Will you agree with me there to 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 a point that you know you 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 joined the Warriors because of the shows I did about them? I hope. I, I know you've said that before. I know you were one of two. Uh, one of them had to quit because of his injury, but uh, I'm pretty sure you're one of two guys that joined the Warriors because of the show, right? And, and to me, that made the show a success, right? It absolutely did. Uh, I don't even know where my Warriors jersey is. I've got it somewhere, right? I, I got it. I got it laying around here somewhere. See? Uh-huh. He, 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 he he loves me. Chris oh, I loves know me. he does. Right? So, so that that did, so I do do hope that he understands where I was going and other people understand where I was going that you know that yes I'm jealous and and you know maybe someday but who knows right um I I just think for the blues they really have to they have to be goldfish they absolutely have to be goldfish I agree okay for everybody watching who's that a reference to? Let's see who gets it. I, I think Ashley might know it. Maybe. But I, I know somebody out there knows what that's a reference to. Right? Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, I'll take that. Because I was going to say, yeah, but if you didn't even know about it, you would have never asked her. But, you know, I, I'll, give, I'll, give it to, I'll give it to her. Cause she's been a good supporter too. And I'll, pre- I'll give it to her. Right. Um, I mean, hell, she let you move 50 miles. So you could play more. Right. Right. I mean, you, you move so you could play more. So you got to give her credit for that. Right. Um, come on. Someone's got to know where the goldfish reference comes from. Somebody, somebody. Tick, I, sh- I need to get a tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Yeah, get 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 one of those, right? Uh, I could always do one of these. <laughs> I can't do that. that one's almost as good as this one. Yeah, I that actually was a good time for that. Yeah, I actually think that that should have been a suspension, mm-hmm. right? Um, it, you know, he's at the point now, nothing a fine doesn't affect him. Uh, I mean, he's been suspended eight times. You're gonna find him 5k for that. I mean, the cross check wasn't that, um, it wasn't that, it wasn't that bad, right? It wasn't that bad. But it's because of his history, it makes it worse. Yep. Right? And that's how I see. And by the way, the goldfish reference was Ted Lasso. Let's be goldfish because they have the shortest memory. I figured it would be that because I hadn't seen it. Everything's from Ted Lasso that comes out of your mouth. <laughs> you're going to, you, you know what? When, when the new season comes out in, in August, you're going you're gonna to have to watch it. Right? I don't have Apple TV, man. You know, I may have to send you my my account, right? Because that is, first of all, Apple TV has most of what's on there is pretty decent. Some of it I don't like, some of it, but uh, the two main series they have, I both like, uh-huh. right? Uh, Brian says he got slashed by the goalie, but his slash was harder and an unprotected area in the arm. He also has. History with the league, so I agree. Yeah, no, I, that was all behind him. Ted Lasso, the one with Ed Helms. I don't think so. Ted Lasso. Oh, what is the name of the guy in in Ted Lasso? I can't think of his name now. Um, Jason Sudeikis. That's Jason Sudeikis, right? Uh, but Apple TV. Ted Lasso, first of all, is that fish out of water story that is so well written that it, it just it, it, it really it, it sets itself apart but then they have the one called the morning show which is based on what happened with good morning i oh, was it good morning america i think with um 
with uh oh who what was the guy the guy that oh they used to do where in the world with him oh i can't think of the one they got fired for um sexual harassment i can't think of his name now somebody will remember it um matt lauer ah that one right it, 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 it's a little bit off of that, and it, and it, and it explores that. It, it's 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 pretty well written, but there's some of it that doesn't that that stops it a little bit. And it, it it's like in season two they got into the beginning of COVID, right? Mm-hmm. When COVID hit and and that uh, that's got Jennifer. Oh wow, Shigerskin is laying on the ice. Something, but I didn't see what happened to him. That's oh bad. wow, Shigerskin is laying on it. He is not moving. He's breathing, but he's not moving. Oh, They're all fighting no. him around him. Huh? Oh, no. He's just, I can't even say his name. Shesterkin yeah. is, I mean, really impressive. So if he goes down, that's that's a huge loss. And, yes, Matt Lauer can suck it. Oh, I can't stand Will Ferrell. I cannot stand Will Ferrell. I don't One enjoy him things. except for in uh, Daddy's Home, that one with... Um, Mark uh, Wahlberg was pretty Wahlberg, good. Wahlberg, yeah. No, there's there's nothing. I. Oh, that's a, oh yeah, that's a fine. All right, that's a suspension. That's an absolute suspension. Oh wow. Which player was it? Uh, number seventy-seven Smith, I think it is on the pen, on Penguins. Carter, Carter. Carter, yeah, and he's just now. I, I, you do see Sierski and kind of lean into it, you know, trying to to put his hip out there, but uh, Carter just just levels him, right? I, I mean, now that I see it, the more the more I see it. Oh, but it's the knee to knee. Mm-hmm. It's knee to knee. You see the way he flips out. That's knee to knee, right? Yeah, that's knee to knee. Wow. That, that's going to be, it might be a fine. There's going to be some penalties here. Uh, they gave it, they gave the one for the goaltender interference and they gave matching minors for a roughing. All right. With an empty net. So the Rangers are going to be five on five. There's uh two Oh four left and they're down five to two. Right. Uh, side of the knee or on the pad. Ah, uh, it looks like, Oh, that's neat. Well, he's catching the pad, but you look at it. You look at him. It's still right where the knee is on that pad, and and I don't know. It's, it's he looks like he's okay. It looks like he just had the wind knocked out of him. Oh, they're saying just, they're blaming just Scareskin for it on uh, TNT. Wow. Eddie is saying the goalie's leg went first. No, it did look like his leg went first. Um, if it was the hip that that he landed on, the trainer was reached the top reached the top of his shorts. Yeah, it might, he might have landed on his hip. Uh, why didn't David Pasternak get in trouble for his goal today on Antarana? I don't know, my friend. I don't know. Right, the because player safety is a joke. They're the dopes, right? Yep. It was the momentum of him going back to the to the neck, possible, possible there. Um, I even forget what I was talking. Oh, I was talking about Apple TV a little bit. Mm-hmm. Uh, but then they got that movie out there that is absolutely just. When I saw it when I was home in St. Louis, the um, Coda, right? Uh, Coda, it, it, the one that won the best Oscar. I don't care what you you know what your opinion of Hollywood is or anything. That is one of the best movies I've seen in a long time. That it, like I watched it and didn't feel like I was watching a movie. Hmm. Right? It felt so connected to real life. Yeah. Like I was invested in all of the characters. Right? Th- th- it's rare that you get a movie that does that that invest you in everyone and that when there is really no there's no bad guy right there was no bad guy it was the environment was the bad guy oh wow so so it's it's so well done and then they've also they also did uh greyhound which was the world war ii destroyer movie and and that gave me that gave me and i don't want to say flashbacks but it gave me some uh 
little bit, a little, little, little bit of PTSD and dreams there. Yeah. Right. You know, because while I wasn't on a destroyer, while I was on a destroyer, I was on a cruiser, and no, it wasn't the same as being shot at with with missiles, but being in a minefield and stuff like that. that stuff kind of comes back to you, right? Yeah. Um. Uh, no, I have not seen C on Apple TV, but I've heard it's very good. Right. This is the one where everybody's blind. Everybody's blind. And they're fighting to win the power of sight. Uh-huh. I think that's what it is. So um, it, it's really good. They have Reeves on the power play. <laughs> oh, they're trying to they're, they're trying to, to bang somebody. All right. This, this game's over anyways. You know, it's five to three with a minute left. So we're going we're gonna to get our uh, Colorado and... We'll get to watch Colorado for about 15 minutes or so before we go off the show, depending on, you know, if somebody else shows up, maybe we'll talk a little longer. I don't know. Uh, Ashley's probably bored with me by now. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Boring is sitting there declining all the orders because people are only wanting to tip three bucks. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking about doing um, doing that again. I mean, I when I did it for Bike Squad, I absolutely hated it, but it sounds like they've changed it enough now. Uh-huh. Um, I, I know somebody else is doing it, and they they seem to be doing pretty good. I just can't have, you know, I just don't want to do. When I worked for Bite Squad, um, when I when I worked for Bite Squad, it destroyed me. Uh, I was I know that they were stealing my tips. I know that you know. One night, I, I look at the island I live on. I drove over a hundred miles one night. Uh-huh. Right, my truck. I actually lost money that night. I proved to them that I lost money and they're like, Oh, you didn't drive that far. I says, you need to go look again because I tracked my mileage and I showed him my mileage and then they came back and they ended up giving me a $10, $10. And I was pissed. I said, that's not enough. Right. Um, I, I only did it cause I had to, uh, to survive at the time. And you know, I was glad I left. Uh-huh. Yeah. You know, it, it's, it's, yeah, it, it's a pretty, I, I've heard, I've seen it. It's like now, but they're back in bank Vikings time, you know? Uh-huh. So, so, you know, it's, it's interesting. Uh, my stepdad told me about the train on your island. Uh, we don't have a train anymore. Well, we we're, we're they're trying to build a, uh, a rail. And, and that's become a, 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 a farce, right? I, maybe I'm saying this wrong. Is it faux for fake? Is that a way to say fake? I thought it was faux. Faux. Okay, that's what I was trying to say. That's why, you know, we'll talk about this real quick. Baruby pulling the goalie with seven minutes left, right? Uh-huh. And everybody went ballistic. You have to understand how much sense it made, Right. It made had, absolutely again, zero sense when we don't have control of the puck. That is the true statement there. Mm-hmm. That's the only bad part of this. But it did make sense to pull the goalie. He should have waited until we had control of the puck. Mm-hmm. It gave us, and what was it again? How do you say it again? Faux. Faux. It gave us a faux power play. Mm-hmm. Five on four. In there should have been in their zone with you know all of that stuff happening. You 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 can make you you could have they could have scored on that. Uh-huh. Right? They absolutely could have scored on that. However, doing it before we ever have the puck, that's the issue. Uh-huh. Right? It it should you should have waited to the puck. Right? I know Lance Lance reached to me offline. And said mm-hmm. he uh, he was hurting and he was sorry that he got all mad at me and all of that and you know, but it's you know no I thought it was good debate, you know I get what he was trying to say, but at the same time I think that there's things that I was trying to say. Mm-hmm. I didn't really have a problem with either of your guys' discussion and no I think the Bruins are gone. Yeah, they're gone. They they, they might get a game. They might get a game. They might get two. Right, it might go three one, and then they get one back. But I think I I, I don't think that they're gonna. Get I think they can win one at home. Maybe. Right, but that's a big maybe. 
Well, you know, you, you never know. Carolina is who they're playing, right? Yeah. Yeah. They don't really have a chance in that series. Carolina has their third string goalie and a guy that can't even speak uh, English. And their lines are so good, it doesn't matter. Is that Mark McGuire on this uh, direct TV commercial? Have you seen it? I don't see commercials. Okay. They've got a direct TV commercial on with the baseball player for MLB baseball. And I think one of them's Mark McGuire, <laughs> right? But I can't be for certain, right? It kind of looks like him. Um, if anybody's seen that and they know, let me know. Uh, they, they, they're, they're instead of um, the Ghostbusters, they're the Cable Busters, <laughs> right? That's so, you. yeah, it, it, it's kind of interesting what they're doing there. Uh -huh. um, I, I am interested in this in, in how uh, Nashville comes out tonight. I really am. I, I want to see what Nashville is going to do early because I'll tell you what, right now, the Avs think that this series is over. Oh, everyone thinks that series is over, except for me. I'm hoping that Soros comes back in game three. I do too. <laughs> His nickname is Coochie. <laughs> Coochie. Coochie. Oh, I can see dear. it now. Coochie. Coochie. Oh, Coochie. <laughs> it sounds like a Japanese name. You know, a Japanese can't. Coochie. Coochie. Uh, I think that's enough. Coochie. Huh? I think that's enough. I don't think so. <laughs> yes, it's very unfortunate, Brian. Oh my goodness. That 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 was just too good. <laughs> um, so it looks like uh puck drops coming up here very shortly. Mm-hmm. I, I, and I want to see I want to see what happens at puck drop maybe we'll do a kind of a reaction show to the first couple of minutes of this and see, see what we're doing how we're doing um got about 10 minutes left we might go a little bit longer we might go through the first period let's see can you handle that I might have to pop out and uh come back but yeah yeah sure go beat up one of your kids no it's called bladder control I need to do oh. <laughs> yeah Layla Leia. Leia. Um, no, 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 no. She's an angel. I don't slap her around, but she's been sick, so. Then, then the other one. Um, Allie, one was, Allie huh? was sick today. Allie, yeah, Allie's the one. Mm -hmm. No, actually, it's Addison that usually is the one in trouble. Addison? <laughs> yeah. My middle child is a little hellion. Uh, oh, wow. They. Yeah. <laughs> oh, now um, she's getting defensive. She heard that, and she's, what? <laughs> Of course. Uh, the, yeah, the Preds are, yeah, the abs are just taking it away. Um, tell everybody that. Preds won the, won the faceoff, but the Avalanche took back. They already, oh, I guess they didn't get a shot on goal. And the Preds are just dumping it in, trying to make something happen. But it, it just looks, it looks like it's six on five is what it feels like. I'm perfect. You're what? Yep, that's that's the middle child. What did she say? I didn't hear what she said. She said, I'm perfect. Perfect? Yeah, she says she's perfect. Yeah, there's there's no such thing as perfect child. <laughs> no such thing. I raised two of them. Trust me, I know. You didn't um, raise my daughter, Allie. Right? Uh, the, 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 I, I, there, there's no such thing as a perfect child. No such thing. I disagree. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> um, well, it, it, it's still shotless, um, but, you know, the abs are just, they're, they're all over the place, mm -hmm. right? It, 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 it's almost like it should be illegal how good all the abs players are, right? Yeah. Like, how, how, how do they have all these guys under the salary cap, right? Because they all took team-friendly deals. Yeah, uh, they did a lot more than team-friendly deals. There's, there's, you know, well, you got Kadri who's playing better than he's ever played in his life. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, but I don't see Aaron them says being it looks like Randy him. Johnson. Yeah, it could be Randy Johnson, but it also, to me, it looks like it does look like Mark McGuire, and it sounds like McGuire, but I could be wrong. Right? Um, so now I'm just trying to keep an eye on, on what's going on in this game here a little bit. So that's why my head's turned because my TV's over to the side, not directly in front of me. Excuse me. What is your expectations for tomorrow's game there, Ash? Well, I think that they're going to come out a little hungrier. Um, they're going to be in front of the home fans, so they're going to have that, you know, behind them. But they're going to come out and take it a lot more seriously. I'm sure that Baruby gave them quite the lashing, but it'll all depend on who we have on defense. That's going to be the big struggle. Not who we have in goal but who we have on defense, because if we're still going to be down Scandella um, and Letty, then, I mean, you think about it, we got Mikula, we got uh, um, Rosen and uh, Santini. Oh, Santini. And I mean, Santini did well last season in the playoffs when we pulled him up, but that's three week links. <laughs> yeah. And I, I mean, they're going to have to split Krug and Falk to put them you know, yeah. so that we at least have experience on half of a line. Yeah. Because I, I would hate to see a line of uh, Rosen and uh, Santini. Santini. Yeah, I'm, I'm with you on that. I, I'd like to see that. But yeah, you're trying to towards the end there, Ryan. Fingers crossed we at least get Letty back. Uh, I just Googled it, uh, and it's Randy Johnson. Okay, thanks, Aaron. I wasn't sure. And I, and I appreciate that. Shockey says there's a big difference between Mark and Randy. Maybe. But it, it just, to me, it kind of looked like him. So uh, I, I mean, appreciate it. It's Randy heads. Johnson. So I appreciate that. I have not heard about Samuel Marin. What about him there, Brian? Uh, what do you think about the playoffs so far through the game ones that we've seen? I mean, I like it. It, it doesn't look like there's any team besides in the Boston series that is dominating i think that every series is at least going to go to six games except for the boston series they are going with uh they're going with upper body they're not saying anything more than that and did i wake up in a better mood ah somewhat <laughs> i'm still feisty though i get myself in it's trouble because i'm too feisty right uh they might not announce it about more i don't think they will I honestly don't think they will. Um, I, I I mean, if... I mean, with Bortuzzo, you know he's either got a concussion or he got cut, broken jaw. No, that he's got a broken, he's broken skull. He's got a broken skull. Mm -hmm. right? and, and how do you put a cast on a skull? You don't. Right? I, I, yeah, you know, you have to... But I couldn't really quite see if it hit him more in the jaw or more in the temple. So I think it hit him in the temple, mm -hmm. right? Um, well, the one thing we know, it didn't knock him out because he got right up and left oh, yeah. the ice. That's why I think it was more in the jaw. Uh -huh. Right. But usually if you break your jaw, you bleed. Mm, unless right? he didn't spit it out. Yeah. Um. He has announced his retire due to the way too many knee injuries and doctor's recommendations. Recommend him to retire. He's only 26, but the Flyers team said he will have a meeting with me for a job in the Flyers manager. Oh, that's good. Uh, who is that's that? That's good. What? Uh, you, he thought it was right in the ear hole. Um, I've, right, I feel a temple shot. He ain't getting up. And, and it's possible. Again, we don't know. Mm -hmm. It really uh, didn't give he, us a good clear shot other yeah. than we know that it hit him in the side of the head. Brian says his shoulder was up like he was bleeding or holding something up. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it was, Which maybe means it was holding his jaw. jaw. <laughs> yeah. Right. Oh, the Avalanche just scored. Going to be one of those games again. Yeah, it's going to be one of them. Uh, Thanks, where are we at? Okay. Thank you, Brian, for that information. We're, we're, we're glad for that. Yeah, it's going to be one of those games. It, it's going to be, you know, the – we thought the Preds were going to have a chance, but – They will if they get Soros back. 
Yeah. Two games Maybe, down but... doesn't mean you're down. Like you still have time. Well, I mean, like they say, it's it's not a series oh. until the home team loses. He's answering for you. This guy right. played both positions, but now he's injured. The Samuel okay. Moore. Oh yeah. That yeah. That was a. Uh... See, and that's that's actually really really rare. Mm -hmm. Right. That a, a guy plays both defense and forward. Right. Um, to me, he was holding his head like when you got slapped in the ear. Possible. Yep. One nothing, Aaron. We got you. Um, ah, excuse me. Well, tomorrow should be a fun day. Uh, we'll be on at uh, seven thirty Central Standard Time, Central Daylight Time. Um, I'm going. I'm doing an hour for the playoffs. I just think it, I think a half hour with the playoffs. We've got so much to talk about, and we've had 20, 25, 30 people. There's so many comments. It's not enough. Uh -huh. Right. Um, uh, I'm not with that, Nick. I, I I think that series goes seven, and it's anybody's series still, to be honest. Uh -huh. And Ryan, I hope so. I really hope so. I hope we can we can make that building rock and and take uh -huh. um take the wild out of it. I agree. Right. We we we've, we've got to if we take it. I think game three, the winner of game three wins the series. Uh -huh. I really do, um, because of the way the Wild won, the way that both teams won. I think Game Three is going to be very, very, very telling. I agree. Right, uh, Game Three is 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 going to be a a, a thriller novel. Um, going to be one of those. It's going to be a Tom Clancy read. You uh -huh. know, there's going to be you, you know it's going to be thrilling and exciting, but there's going to be a lot of detail to it lot of detail to it and, and i think that that is what's going to if detail becomes involved uh -huh. i think i don't mean remember merrick schwartz blues goalie merrick schwartz i don't remember him i don't know if he ever he, <laughs> he, he, but nick <laughs> we need ashley to get press credentials to get into games we've tried nick We've absolutely freaking tried and been denied completely, right? Especially the playoffs, you know, regular season, maybe we'll get, but for the playoffs, it's, it's only for the, the big newspapers and TV. That's it. Yep. No one else matters. Right. Uh, who is this? It's telling me the have scored on their first shot tonight. Uh, I just tell can't you something. tell. Say again. I can't tell. Erickson. Uh, Erickson. Erickson. Erickson Krieger. Welcome Erickson. Thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate you tonight. Don't forget to give that thumbs up like Brandon White and Drew Boyd did. More guys from the uh, from the, the Hockey Warriors. I really do appreciate you guys. I really, really do. I, I miss the Warriors, I'll tell you. Uh, um, I miss that group so bad, right? I, I mean, I'm, I'll tell you what I miss the most. And, and, and actually, I miss it because I've never had it. But they have a closeness, like their, their group chats and things like that. Mm -hmm. I can't be a part of that. Even though I'm an honorary member, they don't want me to be a part of that. And, and that's the thing that, you know, that there's days like today and yesterday where I could really use something like that, a support yeah. like that. But, you know, I understand why they didn't do it. Uh, six games with the Blues it was great in the AHL for their uh, time with the Blues minor, the Peoria Rivermen. Well, that had to be a while ago because we haven't had the Rivermen for almost 10 years. Mm-hmm. Right, it's been, it's been almost ten years since we've had the Rivermen. Oh wow! I mean, they're just buzzing. They're just buzzing. I mean, they look like they're on a power play. Yeah, that's pretty much what they looked like the other night, all game. Yeah, and then and, and and not only that, uh, Nashville's playing like they're on a penalty kill. Uh huh. Right, Nashville's absolutely playing like they're on a penalty kill. Well. Um, Ash, thanks for a great night. Thanks for coming on. Uh, we'll we'll have um, more tomorrow. We'll have all you know all four shows tomorrow. Uh, Saturday, I'm not sure yet. Saturday, I may not do a show because uh, Doctor Strange and the Multiverse comes out, and I I'm a big um, I don't want to say Marvel fan, but Marvel movie fan, uh -huh. right? I'm not a comic book fan. In fact, I normally I actually up until a certain movie did not like comic book movies. Like I hadn't seen the Avengers. I hadn't seen, um, 
Age of Ultron, Civil War. I, I haven't seen, seen any, any of them it. except for the Spider-Man movies. Right? I hadn't even seen, like, the last Spider-Man movie I saw was Spider-Man 3 with Tobey Maguire. Well, I've right? seen all the Tobey Maguire. I saw, oh my gosh, I'm forgetting his name, but um, Andrew Garfield. Yeah, Andrew and Garfield. I've seen uh, all of the modern ones. I've always yeah. liked Spider-Man, though. So, uh, yeah. And I saw the Iron Mans, but I have yeah. not seen any of the others. Well, I saw the original Iron Man. I, I think I saw Iron Man 2, but I didn't see it. Like all, all I, I remember seeing bits and pieces of it. There's things I didn't mm -hmm. see. That's when Nick Fury gets introduced and all this other stuff, mm -hmm. um, and and Natasha gets introduced and that. But it wasn't until I saw there was like a long period, like Iron Man two. It wasn't until I saw Doctor Strange. I haven't seen Doctor Strange, but I did like him in the most recent Spider Man movie. So yeah. that I might he, go watch them, but I don't yeah, feel like it was for it yet. was Doctor Strange when I finally seen that that I jumped on and went back and started watching the other Marvel stuff. Um, Iron Man 3 wasn't the worst. I the, the, See, for me, and, and just real quick, for me, the one that took me out of comic book movies was the original Incredible Hulk, right? Yeah, there was but they a, there recast was, that. They did it twice, mm -hmm. okay? They recasted the Incredible. There were actually two Incredible Hulks. There was an Incredible Hulk before Iron Man. Mm -hmm. right? And that's the one I'm saying they recasted because um, Edward Norton didn't do what no, they no. wanted him. Edward Norton was in the one that came, that Hulk came after Spider-Man or after Iron Man. There was actually an Incredible Hulk before that one. This one was supposed to be a sequel to it with Edward Norton. And then they recast the Hulk with um, Mark Russo or however Ruffalo. you say it. Ruffalo. Yeah. Um, I can't wait. To, well, She-Hawk comes out next year, I think, and, and that might be a better one. Uh, but the original, if you look back, there's a, the original, it's a CGI, uh -huh. Incredible Hulk, and it is just horrible. Mm. Horrible. And then I mean, they came I out watched with the, the TV show when I was a kid, but. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, so I think both those guys have, have since passed. Uh -huh. I, I, know, I know the bodybuilder has, uh -huh. but I think... Um, I think uh, the the guy that played uh, Bill Bixby, he's also mm -hmm. passed now. I think he yeah. passed not too long ago, a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. so, and Brian, like yes, that. I enjoy Deadpool. All right. I, I, I like the first one. I didn't see the second one. Mm -hmm. Right? So oh, apparently I, Deadpool, Deadpool is supposed to be in this one. Mm -hmm. All right? They're supposed to, in this, uh, um, Doctor Strange, they're supposed to connect them. Okay. Right? So, okay, guys, uh, what a night. Thank you. It is one nothing Avalanche. Maybe the uh, – but Nashville has more shots, 6-4, to four, so maybe they can get something by. Mm -hmm. Maybe Kemper will, 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 will be kind of weak there. Oh, oh, that – you know what? Oh, wow, that wasn't the goal. But that almost looked like that same play with, with Tarasenko last season in the playoffs where McKinnon's coming down and Tarasenko tries to hit him in the board and McKinnon just goes right on by him. Mm -hmm. It looked like that. Uh, they did make a Green Goblin movie for a while, I think. Oh, no, no, no. They're talking about making a Green Goblin, mm -hmm. I think. Right? Um, I'm thinking of the Green Lantern or... Yeah, you're those. thinking of Green Lantern. Or or what was the other one? Uh, Green Hornet. That's what I'm thinking of. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. I think we've talked about enough other stuff. Let's have a great night. Thanks, Ashley. Talk mm -hmm. to you later. Aloha. Mm -hmm.